Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to use some of Giraffe's drafting aids to draft more precisely. Uh, so this question we're often getting is how do I draw a line parallel to another line? You know, so if I just draw line, it's hard to make sure that this line is parallel to Piper Street. You know, so if I, let's try it, I mean, maybe I eyeball it in like that and then I drag it across and it's not quite parallel. You can see, if you know, it's coming in a bit. Okay, so there's two ways I'll show you. The first is you can right click uh, and in Giraffe you right click anywhere on the map whatever features are being rendered on the map are queried by the right click and when we query the features we get their geometry which is this black line that flashes on and off as I hover on it and we also get their properties. So look up at the top left and you can see uh, what's happening there. And so I can just click create which will bring this line into Giraffe and of course this line is the Piper Street geometry and so then if I move it I have um, I need to select it I have moved Piper Street exactly parallel so that's the first way of creating that geometry like the second way is a little uh, more complicated and I will do it now so uh, giraffe has an extrude function that we're going to leverage in order to uh, get a line directly parallel to Piper so the first thing we're going to do is uh, draw a U-shape. And as I'm drawing this thing, I was holding down S to snap to the ends. So critically, this point and this point were snapped to the end of the Piper Street geometry. So if I turn this off, that Piper Street geometry and what we've got here, these two endpoints, um, have been snapped together. Then what I can do is that I can extrude out by grabbing on these little handles and when I do that of course this extrusion remains completely parallel to Piper Street. Now the advantage of this method is I can extrude out and you can see Giraffe is rendering how far I've extruded out and a little known tip is if I type in a distance I want to extrude uh, Giraffe will take the extrusion there. So if I type in 25 we've now extruded exactly 25 meters and then I can delete these kind of assistance uh, tails that I made and I now have a geometry exactly parallel to Piper Street and exactly 25 meters away from Piper Street. The final way I'll show you is to use the offset. So if I right click to create this geometry and then I add guideline offset and I set that to 25 and push enter I get a bounding, uh, I get a box around Piper Street exactly 25 meters away and what I can then do is I can use the snap command by holding down S and draw a line exactly 25 meters from Piper Street and also parallel to Piper Street. So that's three ways of getting precise distances and precise parallel uh, lines.